show you what we're getting. What we getting. So this is our this is our gear that we need. Um, let's just zoom in. Let's get, zoom in, please. Thank you. So um, these will be our new stats down here. Oh my gosh, it's subbed. I haven't streamed in so long, and people are subbing. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to the craft box. My name is Brent, and today we will cry. Probably. Rose, thank you for the 38 months sub. Amazing. Very long time. Um, I always use that deck. I learned over time to only put in the amount of cards I need. Yeah, I know, and I do that as well, but I just prefer having a lot in case I'm, like, need to carry more, you know? Like, if we're going up against a hard boss fight and I need to carry 100 trillion blades and stuff, then, you know, I can do that. So, it's a slight change for me. Not that I usually carry any more than what I what I usually because what I usually just have. Um, hold up, I need it. Oh, actually, tab in. Um, I only usually carry this, which is fine. Like this is all I need in my deck. But I like to have like as many possible slots as possible in case I need to like you know help the team and put in like a hundred trillion dark packs because I'm doing team up and people are shit. So you know, it happens. It happens. Um, right. So yeah, this is the gear that we're getting. We need the Lemuria hat, um, the Lemuria robe, the Lemuria Afame. So those are the top tier. We need to farm uh, last boss or craft them, either or. Probably farm last boss would be best bet, I would say. Um, we need the Supreme Horror Staff, which we can farm the Croc side boss thing for, I believe. Um, we need the Dragoon Amulet, so we could do a little bit of, like, um, Abandoned House Runs if we wanted to. We're not doing Aphrodite today, I'm not in the mood for Aphrodite, she's, she's cancelled for now. Um, so yeah, those are the options. We can either farm Hall of Heroes, um, the Croc Boss, the Star Croc Boss, or, um, do a little bit of, uh, a little bit of, um, Catacombs. What do you want? <clears throat> what do you want? How do you cancel a plant? I cancelled her because she's not on my stream, so therefore she's cancelled. Just saying. Kind of cringe. Imagine not being in my stream. That's cancelled, in my opinion. That's cancelled, in my opinion. So what do you... What do you... What would you want to see today? Would you want me to, like, do Lemuria stuff? Or, or like, um, Dragoons? Or what are we thinking? Little things that annoy ducks. Volume... One, when you order a drive through but the drink is filled to the brim. So when you put the straw in, it overflows, and you have to look at like a farm animal so it doesn't spill. <laughs> ah, that's true, that's true. Hi, Ducks, welcome. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Hall of Heroes. So does Dylan want to help me with Hall of Heroes? If I do anything like Hall of Heroes, I will have to have help for. So if we do that, that's the only thing that requires me getting help from chat. So, yeah, that, that's the only thing that requires me to get help from chat. Otherwise, I can solo everything else, and I can get good myself. Um, hi, Wow Mage. Welcome. Welcome, welcome, welcome. So, Dylan's wanting to help with Hall of Heroes, by the sounds of it. If anybody else wants to run Hall of Heroes, let me know. We can do that. We're doing that, apparently. We're in Rom Dwargan. Let's head over to Lemuria. Lemuria. Lemuria hardly know her but we are here nonetheless dylan's online he's popping off he popping off popping off um how are you today wow mage how's it going how are you on this fine beautiful monday i always forget that it's monday for you i was about to say tuesday and then i'm like it's not tuesday it's monday why am i in a bad realm i'm in rum dwargan obviously because why are you not allowed to why are you not allowed to switch realms in here? King's Isle, what are you what are you hiding in here that makes me not want to switch realms? I don't understand. Zero out of ten. Would not recommend. Would not recommend. Um We've still got an hour of work. Wish you could help. It's okay. Work takes priority. I understand. I understand. Completely understand. I would be the same as well. Um Right. Right. I love the Lemuria music. It's so good. Um, I haven't done this in forever. I forgot what I need to carry. We need to kill the left side first, I believe. Um, let's carry some 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 scarecrows and some ship of fools. Hi, Dylan. 
And some blanks, sounds good. We might carry one less of those. We'll put in another one of these. Do, 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 do. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Um, <clears throat> we can blade, right? I'm pretty sure we can. I'm pretty sure we can blade. If anybody else wants to help, feel free to come and join. Um, Rosa, if you want to help, you can. Because surely you want some, you want some tier, top tier, level one fifty gear, right? Right, Rose, right? Or are you too good for level one fifty gear? You're like, nah, I don't need them. I'm better than that. I am simply built different. It's probably what she will say. We can blade. Okay, good. I'm glad. I am glad. Honestly, like filled with happiness at that. Um, let's just carry like a little bit less like that and um, we need another sharpener as well sharpen we're also going to carry frenzy yeah, should we do frenzy or should we do virulent ones we'll do a couple of those couple of those boom bam thank you ma'am you have to eat soon what do you mean eat it's a bit of an inconvenient time well maybe maybe eating at an inconvenient time is not a good idea <laughs> I'm just kidding. Ha ha ha. Ha ha. Ha ha. Please don't fight me. Because you would probably win. Please don't. Please no fight. Please no fight. Um, yeah. Alright. Me and Dylan duoing this. Maybe. Maybe. Is it gonna happen? Dylan, do you think we can duo this? Are we good enough to duo? We do the duo. Duos. I mean, me and Rose managed to do it, so surely me and Dylan can do it, right? Right? <laughs> right? That that would sound legitimately okay. Um, yeah, we good? Okay, cool. I mean, we can heal each other. Oh, right, we can heal ourselves, so it's pretty decent. Pretty decent. Left side first, correct? Um, the animations are alone and enough time to make a sandwich. So true, dude. So true. Oh my gosh. Never has more truth been spoken. Right. Left side first, yeah. Shadow first. Shadow first, and then the other dudes. I didn't bring any prisms because I'm an idiot, but it's okay. It's okay. Surely prisms? We don't need them. We don't need prisms, no. You haven't been on Twitch in a while? Well, welcome back. I'm doing well. How are you today? Hope you're doing well. Um, we're just doing some Hall of Heroes. Hall of Heroes. Minus 10. I forgot about that. Just as well, I'm going to get rid of that. Ha ha. Activate. Good job, Shadow. Oh, that's right. Card limits. Forgot about that. Forgot about that. Trying to remember the name I had when I was here. Um. Hmm. Hold up. Let me let me see if I can if I can figure it out. Um. Do, 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 do. Um, um, well, I can tell you, you were last here on the 1st of the 2nd, 2020, I think, by the sounds of it. Oh no, the 1st, the 28th of January, 2020, a long time ago. Yeah. OG Buck Venom. I don't remember either of those names, but I don't mind. Welcome back. Welcome back. Alurian. What do you want me to call you? What do you want me to call you? How do we, how do you pronounce? I can't England goodly today, ever. Man carrying that brace was clutch. Not gonna lie, very clutch. Um, I'm gonna death blade. Death blade. Death blade. Death blade. Blam. Ho ho. Okie dokie. Frenzy. Dylan popping off here. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Pop off, Dylan. Pop off. Okay, so for those of you who haven't seen this fight, basically it's painful and scary, and there's eight people versus two. It's great. And um, kind of the strat is to defeat the first, the left side four first. 
um, and then defeat the others afterwards. We might do a reset in between them. Uh, as long as you don't defeat Stallion, I think it is. He's the one, he's like the actual boss that will drop stuff. Um, so as long as you don't defeat Stallion, you can come back and go away and all of that good stuff. 1%, 1% chance. Do we take it? We take it. We take it. We take the 1% chance. Easy. You haven't actually seen this fight before? Well, I'm glad I've just told you what happens. It's great. Um, I think also this is a bubble that real... I think it caps damage. I think. I can't remember. I fizzled. Unlucky. That 1% chance. Not today. Not today. Um, yeah, I'm pretty sure it's a damage cap. Is that correct, Dylan? Dylan will know. He's smart. Dylan's smart. He knows all of the things. Flee, flee before the savage sword of Mandar. Exactly. Mandar's scary, man. He'll get you. He has big sword and he, he's got big sword energy. And that's not okay. That's not okay. You've got to be careful of his big sword energy. Tempest, really? Really? You're going to tempest me like that? Dude. Damage cap is that global. Yeah, cool. I, I, I thought so. How hard is this boss? It's not too bad. Um, I managed to duo it with my friend in test drum and we were both fighters so not in test drum as soon as it was released in live drum so it's not too bad um cleanse yeah i can cleanse you dude i can cleanse you i might fizzle but i can cleanse you i might fizzle i i may fizz i may fizz but we'll see i do be fizz i do be fizz though i will do it again i will do it again i try next <laughs> Oh, no, stun. Ugh, Manda. Okay, it's just Dylan. That's okay. That's okay. That's okay. Why does Manda look like knockoff guts? I don't know, man. I don't know. I don't know. You can solo it if you have no plans for the entire day. True. True, true, true. That's ducks. That's ducks. Here it comes. No, thank you. I don't want you to come. Please stop. Why do I say sus stuff all the time? I don't know. Um. <clears throat> dun, 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 dun. um. But yeah, he's, he's not too bad. As long as you take out the, the first four on the left first, you, you should be fine. Um, basically, Shadow casts a... I think it's a 80% block thing. I don't know. I don't know. Spells? I don't know them. I don't know these spells. Hitting next. Okay, Pog. Pog. I just discarded both of my braces, which is not ideal. Not ideal at all. But that's fine. Hopefully this goes through, which it will. No weaknesses. Mantles. Um, this fight looks more chaotic than anything. It is. It is. It's definitely chaotic. That's for sure. That is for sure. It is some chaos is some big chaos um but that's the whole of lemuria you know it's a little bit chaotic all the time you do always go first i believe which is really good really really good um right so i'll blade up and then hit after you this probably won't kill but it will do a decent amount it doesn't you don't need too many blades again because there is a damage cap um which is you know understandable understandable lol um, really seems like they had a cool idea. Screwed up the execution. I don't think they screwed up the execution. I, I think it's a fun fight. It's definitely very different. Um, but it is definitely chaotic. Definitely is chaotic. That's for sure. Um. Um. Bye, Shadow. Get wrecked, loser. <laughs> Never say die. What do you mean, never say die? I will say die to you. Die, stallion, die. Um, I can't English when I'm tired. Help. I can't English full stop, so it's okay. You're valid. You're valid. Very valid. Very, very valid. Kablam, Manda. Hello. Hello, Manda. Um, that's a little bit rude, duck. Not gonna lie. Not gonna lie. A little bit rude. I'll hit next. Um... I think two blades should be fine, probably. It's also 
I have to say, this fight is not as painful as the Caramel fight. The Caramel fight is cool, but it takes a little bit of time. This one is a little bit more quicker, I feel. Which is not terrible. Not terrible. Shush, Salomon. Shush. Shush. No one cares about you. You're going down. I'm not going down. I'm going up. I only go up, baby. <laughs> only go up. I need to pick. I forgot. I need to pick who, who to hit. Who to choose. It doesn't just auto do it. Um, can I do 3,000 through, what, minus 10%? I probably won't kill Solomon, but that's okay. Just because death. Yikers. Yikers. That's unfortunate. <clears throat> I don't know what's right or wrong, so I'm leaving it at that. Fair enough. Fair enough. Fair enough. What do be you do? That was weird. Why are you here? Please stop. Please stop. Um, dun, 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 a gift. I don't like gift. Oh, you can't blade others. That's right. I forgot. I knew there was a blade cheat. I knew there was a blade cheat. It's you can't blade others. That makes sense. But Dylan, that's okay. I appreciate your gift of blade. Very cool. I love how they decide to earthquake the exact round you hit. Yeah, it doesn't remove all blades, which is good. I think it's just one. Which is not terrible. Um, still painful, but not terrible. Um, right, two down. Just one left, I think. Sounds like two. Could be one. Yeah, two down. That's good. Please don't heal the others either. Thank you. Thank you. Whew. Blading someone else with Dark Pack is OP. Is it? Hmm. Get help, Solomon. <laughs> yes, definitely get help. Don't ever use this spell against me. I will, I will, I will kill you so hard. I will kill you so hard, Solomon. You won't have died any more than than you have died now. Um, I can ship a fools in a little bit. I just need at least one more blade. But I'm sure Dylan's got. That will probably reset after the first four. I'm assuming. I'm assuming is the. Is the um, idea, Dylan. Just to get rid of these stupid shields. Stupid shields! Kablam. Um, right. Let us blade. Once. Phantom's cheat makes it 17. Stack with the 25%. Oh, oh wow. Okay. I didn't realize that that... Because it, it would only do it to 1A. Eh? Um, yeah. Because it would only do 1. That makes sense. I'll ship a fools next. Hopefully that kills. What? Th two blades? Yeah. We'll see. If you have another dark pack, Dylan, we could try that. Because that sounds fun to, to do. <laughs> it sounds really fun. Um, I wonder how the Mirage spells would work in this fight. Well, you can only... I believe you can only do one side at a time. Like you can't mo pick and choose the side that you would, you want to fight. I believe that's how it works. I think. I'm pretty sure that's how it works. Could be wrong. Pretty sure that's how it works though. Um, right, crit, lovely, blade, blade, dead. Maybe, maybe dead. Blam. That did nowhere near enough. I'm sorry, Dylan, I have, um, forsaken you. He has so much resist, I forgot. Yikes. I'm pretty sure you can only hit one side at once. You can't, like, pick and choose which side you want to hit. I'm pretty sure that's how it works. I could be wrong. I haven't actually tried it. But I'm pretty sure you can only hit one side. 
at once. Like, you can either choose one of them out of all of eight, or you choose one side and then hit, like, a couple of them. Or you do an AoE, which will hit once one half or the other half. And you can choose that. Dylan's gonna die! No! BRB? Yeah, you better BRB. I'm gonna live this because I'm a tank. I'm a tank! Um, okay. Of course you need a minute. You always need a minute. You always need a minute. What if I didn't want you to have a minute? Just a suggestion. Um, close to crafting Lore Master. I only need the Amber and Agave Nectar. Oh, nice. Agave Nectar is a pain to get. I'll tell you that. It's a pain. It's painful. Can confirm. Agave, kind of painful, not gonna lie. <clears throat> but once you got it, it's not too bad. Amber's not, like, terrible either. I have so much Amber at the moment. It's ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. Um, what is this? Yikes. I'm gonna have to cleanse myself. I wanna get a Grim Reader. I can't find a Grim Reader, though. Let's just cleanse real fast. Um, 24 out of 50 on Nectar. Ooh, that's a, that's a wee ways away. That's a wee ways away. Wee ways away. Um, how many hours do you reckon it will take? I mean, it depends how lucky you are with your agave. I haven't really done a lot of agave since forever, basically. So, I'm not 100% sure. Like, what, what the agave per hour is. But then it's, what, like, 15 to transmute it to nectar. And then you might get a couple of nectar occasionally while you're picking up agave. Um, I don't know. At least a few hours. At least a few hours. I like getting reagents, but I never, like, time it because that makes it feel longer. Sacred charge, really? 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 This is going to do a little bit. I might die here. That would be sad. That would be big sad. That would be big sad. I didn't die, Pog. Stop cursing me! Oh my gosh. Uh, BRB. I need health. I need health. I can't live with 300. 300 is ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. Only two agave from two leaves. Yeah, that happens quite often. Now I get Grim Reader. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, blade. <coughs> he just passed, okay. I love how he comes into the battle circle just to pass. Kind of funny, not gonna lie. Um, I do this. I'm not gonna get a shadow pip anytime soon. Which is slightly unfortunate, but hey, it's fine. We out here. We out here. We'll put this up. And we'll just see Dylan stunned. Unlucky. I'm stunned as well. Unlucky. Unlucky. Kablamo. What was that? I don't even know. I don't even know what that was. Sandstorm. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Triple M. Does like five damage. That's fine. <clears throat> Wings of Fate, really? This is more just annoying than anything. They need to put the creepy Aetherus Moon on this moon, I swear. That would be so funny. That would be so funny. Putting creepy Aetherus Moon on this Wings of Fate moon as well. I think that would be absolutely hilarious. Don't worry, I'm a doctor. Don't worry, I'm a doctor. I do worry, honestly. I do worry. I don't know what that one round means. 
I have no clue what that means. Um, absolutely no clue. Okay, if you're hitting, we're stunned though. We do be stunned though. I just pass. Is that the best you can do, dog? Oof. Rip blade! Um, what would be better is putting in background of every spell. Imagine, that would be so cool. Oh my gosh. It increases the rounds of healing. Ah, okay, that makes sense. So it's like the opposite of cooldown. It's, um, heat up. Because cooldown removes one tick off a dot, right? A healing dot. So it's like a, a, he a heat up, but it's an ice spell, which makes complete sense. Who did it better? Me or me or Solomon? I'm gonna have to say probably probably me. Because Solomon is a crane. And thus meaning he's bad. It's just all we can say, really. All we can say. Why did they decide to put a face on the Authorus Moon? It's been there forever and it's and it is baby, and we must embrace it and love it for all that it is and more. Um I would actually cast Wing Sorrow for once, just a close-up of that amazing face. Imagine. Imagine. That would be so cool. That would be so cool. Oh my gosh. King Zal, put Greepy Authorus face moon on every single spell that has a moon, please. Make it canon moon in, in the spiral. This is the spiral's moon. It just has a creepy face for no reason. <laughs> Imagine. Um, nice wasn't too bad hopefully i can kill i should be able to kill hopefully fingers crossed um they did they did get rid of the face and replaced it with the wing uh wings of fate moon which is sad but they um replaced it after much outrage from people saying please put back face is is key we need face need more face so it got put back right gg oh my really wait did he actually die I think he died. I think he's dead, actually. He just looked like he was still there. So, now we flee. Now we flee and reset. You think you can stun me? No, I am un unstunnable because of stun block. Thank you. That's the greatest thing Rapid ever added to the game. <laughs> so true. Add back Moonface, and he did. Mad lad rat beard. Um Yeah. Right, he is dead, right? He's not dead. He's not dead. Oh my gosh. He's not dead, Dylan. Don't worry, I'll solo this man's. I solo this man's real fast. Don't worry, I got this. I got this. I can hit next and kill. It's all okay. It's all okay. He's just invisible. Love rat. Oh, we don't have pip gain. For next round. That's fine. We do this. We do this. I can kill next, Dylan. Don't worry. I got this. Now you're going to get late cheat, which is sad. Oh, there is no late cheat. Don't worry. Why is there no late cheat? That seems weird. Surely there would be late cheat, right? Um, going invisible. Yeah, it's rounding error. It happens. Mm. It happens. Rounding errors suck. It's, it's, basically, it's to do with pets. Um, when you have a pet that gives damage, the actual damage amount is like a, like a, it could be like 9.98 or something, or like, anything over 0.5 will go up. And if it's like 9.5 and it shows as 10, then on theory, you'll do that t that actual full 10 damage and then it will round at the end of the round back down to the 9.5 and you may not actually kill the person. Um, that's basically where what happens with the rounding error. Um, because at the end of each round, it recalculates how much health you actually have, um, which is so stupid. But hey, whatever, it's fine. Um... And then they come back at the end of the round. It, it, it happens a lot. It happens a lot. It's annoying. 
Um, but basically, that's what happens when you, like, only just kill people. So, if you can, like, fully kill people, that would be recommended. I can't hit because I'm stunned, right? I am stunned. We're gonna try anyway, because one day I'll, I'll cast through a stun and it'll be amazing. Um, what a garbage and outdated system. I mean, it's not, it's not outdated. That's just how, that's just the limitations of the game. I mean, it's better than showing, like, 9.95, you know? On your stats page like that's a little bit ridiculous so i i don't mind it it's just something that you need to take into consideration a little bit um yeah but generally 99.999 percent of the time you're fine it's just those small occasions where you're probably not um but yeah it's just just whiz just whiz just whiz it's okay it's okay we can live with it we can live with it. See, again, he didn't die. <laughs> again, he didn't die. Rounding errors galore. Holy moly. It doesn't help because this man's got so much resist. Um, that we've got enough damage to, like, kill him if he didn't have any resist. But he's got resist. And, yeah. So, again, gotta kill him three times because men's just will not die. Holy moly. Just as well I hit. Is he actually dead this time? Please actually say he's dead. <laughs> uh, just get good and actually kill the mobs. Exactly, man. Exactly. It's not that hard. Just get good. Come on. Okay. We flee. I think. I think we've done it this time. Yeah. But, um, it, it's... That's just how it works. I mean, the easiest way to fix that would be to basically just always round down the stats on pets so like if you had like 9.5 percent damage or 9.5 damage it would just round down to nine instead of going up to ten that would be the easiest way but then you'd still have like recalculations at the end of the round where they may not actually they, they might actually die afterwards which is both good and bad because if that happens you still have to sit through the whole round so yeah because the battle won't end until after that round and it realizes oh wait there's nobody in combat so yeah and that would also be a lot more annoying for players because all of a sudden you may live with like one health and then die at the end of the round and that wouldn't feel too good so there's no real easy way around that um without showing the exact right stats but then you get like damage numbers that will be like 93 point or 993 point six damage or something and that doesn't look as cool you know, that doesn't look as good. So, yeah. It's, it's kind of like a a weird situation that probably won't, like, be fixed too much. And it's, it's, there's not, like, an easy fix to it either. Um, but, yeah. It's just how it is. Boom, boom. Boom, boom. But, yeah. That's just how it be. Let's just be how it is. <clears throat> um, you never actually died in this game. All rounding errors. Exactly, you know. Exactly. I didn't die. It was just a rounding error. But, like, that would be more frustrating if you're going up against a boss and then all of a sudden you died. Or going in PvP and then all of a sudden you died when you shouldn't have. Like, it will show that you didn't die and then you die at the end of the round. That would be a lot more frustrating than the opponent. Especially in PvE. Like, that will be so much more frustrating. It doesn't really happen in PvE. The bosses won't get to a point where they'll, like, not kill you. And it will be, like, a rounding error thing. You won't get that in PvP because, generally, most of the stats in PvP are, like, whole numbers. Um, but in Pv or PvE, sorry, PvP, so much different. You have to, like, take that into account. And I think it's a lot better that the opponent lives than the opponent lives and then dies, you know? That's a little bit... That feels worse. You know, that feels worse for the player than if the opponent comes back to life because you're like, oh my gosh, I say I got saved from death or something. You know, that's a little bit more like hype than, oh, I just died. I didn't say that I died and then I died and people would think that would be a bug. So it's a little bit better the other way around because it's less likely to be thinking it's a bug, if that makes sense. Um, they could set it to a fixed amount rather than a percent. Well, I mean... 
I mean, damage already now is a fixed amount. It's not a percentage anymore. Um, it is just a fixed number. But it still doesn't fix the rounding issues because pets give, um, like, 9.5 damage. Depending on the stats of the pet, that damage increases or decreases. And there's not too much that you can do um, to solve that. Unless you want to have pets not give a range of um a range of numbers and then it's a lot more like unforgiving if you if you fail your pet so i don't think that's the best way to go around this Ugh. can i get some pips please pip please that's a lot more unforgiving to do that so yeah it's just it's just how how it is but basically pets give like a range of between one and um one and x whatever their highest value is um of damage crit um resist and when it rounds it doesn't it just takes in the whole number that is displayed on your stat screen into account to start with um and basically if it's a 0.5 it'll round it up again um it doesn't round down because that feels bad or something i don't know yeah it's just it's just confusing but i think the way that it is to take into account rounding it's better this way than if all of a sudden you were alive and then you died that's that's less fun than if all of a sudden the boss comes back alive with like 100 health because it's not going to be much health that they come back with i think it, some people have had up to a thousand but you know that's that's only like one or two spells it's not the end of the world yeah it's annoying but it's not the end of the world you know but yeah and that's just how it is unfortunately that do be just how is do be is how be if that makes sense <clears throat> right let's see how much this can do two blades mm -hmm. we'll see we'll see we will see crit lovely um shield unlucky okay a couple of them are dead nice 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 <clears throat> just one of them dead unlucky that's fine it's life boy that's dead so that's okay um we're gonna wait we're gonna wait to cast that a little bit 28 of 50 nice you're getting there <clears throat> nearly halfway <coughs> Ugh, my voice is still not like the best yet but i'm definitely a little bit better than i was um last time i streamed jeez um right ouch why would grom give you strength that's a little bit rude honestly rude and uncool rude and uncool um right we'll do this we'll do Aura, and then we'll hit with Ship of Fools. Easy clap. But yeah, there's no real easy way to fix the rounding issue. Unfortunately. No easy way to do it. And I mean, I think as it is, is fine. Yeah, it's a little bit frustrating, but it would be frustrating the other way as well. And probably more frustrating if all of a sudden you just die out of nowhere. So, yeah. I think it's fine. I think it's fine, and I speak for everybody in the community, obviously, because only my opinion counts, so it must be fine. <laughs> that was a joke, by the way, um, in case you didn't realize. Mandara is literally a Guts reference. Probably. There's a lot of references in Wiz. I don't know what that is, because I'm not American, but, um... But yeah, there's a lot of references in this world, like a lot, a lot. And most of the heroes that we're fighting at the moment are like based off story characters and stuff. So, yeah. So, yeah, I wouldn't be surprised if he looks and sounds familiar because he probably is. Main character of Berserk, yeah. All of the heroes are based off like main characters of books and stuff and series and stuff so yeah
Bum, bum. Right. Crit. Kablam. 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 Uh oh, this is gonna hurt. This is gonna do a little bit of damage. Luckily, it's only Snow Angel and not something worse. Snow Angel is good because it does most of its damage over time, which you can kind of deal with. <clears throat> if that was, like, Freeze Ray or whatever the frickin' Ice Lemuria spell is, that would be bad. That would have been pain. Absolute pain. We've got one blade and a... And extra damage. We should be good. Should be good. I was talking to someone about um, Zack Snyder's Justice League and how it was almost four hours. And out of nowhere, she said, I don't care how long it is, as long as it can satisfy me. Wow, that's so insightful. Oh my gosh. You should 100% read because it's a masterpiece. I don't really read much. Like, I really just don't. It's just not something that I'm interested in. I don't have the, like, mental capacity to just sit and read a book for, like, 5 million years. It, or read anything for five million years it's just not something that i'm like i can do my brain just goes a million miles a minute right is this the robe it's not the robe is this the boots it's the life boots of some form i don't think it's the top tier life boots we don't need the don't, don't, oh, 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 the fm it's malevolent fm oh my gosh we actually um uh, might have needed that is it malevolent or merciless, the top tier? I can't remember. I can't remember. What did I need? I did actually need the F aim, so if... That is the... Hold up, I need to check the stats of it. Malevolent's top tier, right? I'm pretty sure malevolent is top tier. Maybe. Um, 18 damage. Um... 19 no it's not it's a uh, it's merciless it's top tier it's merciless yeah i always forget that they both start with m why would they both start them with m that's just that's just cheeky that's just cheeky <laughs> that's just cheeky that's cheeky i don't like that zero out of ten malevolent can be used to craft the the oh the craft the fm actually wait we might do that hold up we might do that how much does that cost how much does that cost Let's figure out real quick. Exit. Why would I want to exit? I guess it counts that whole room as it does. It counts that whole room as the instance. That's interesting to know. Hold up. We'll do one more in a sec, Dylan. I'll just see what else we need to craft the um, the Demiurge. Demigurge. It is cheeky. Why would they both start with M? That's stupid. Malevolent, merciless, basically the same word. There is no difference between them um the is it, it it's destruction why i don't know we need more synthonium another wing sorrow as well mm, mm, mm. okay interesting interesting we can't craft that but that's fine not at the moment at least um i'm just gonna quickly refill potions and then we'll do it again if you want dylan is the gear from the boss better than Dragoon? It depends. It really depends on what you're going for. In my opinion, for what I'm wanting, yes. Um, or for what I'm getting from the boss, yes. Um, but it completely depends on what your stats are and what stats you want and what you're going for. My main goal for my new gear set is to phase away from damage robes. That's literally the whole goal. Um, and still keep basically the same stats that I have currently. I do lose quite a bit for doing that. But also, um, not as much as I would originally have thought. But, yeah, it depends. It depends on what you're going for. I would recommend looking into yourself because I have absolutely no, no idea. Because there's just so many different op options that you can go for. Um, that I have no clue. It really depends on what your preferences are for stats. My main preference at the moment is to get away from damage robes. <laughs> that's my main preference. So that's why we're going for the Lemuria robe here. 
because it gives more health as well. I also wanted a lot of health, like over 10,000 health, which I do. Dylan, do you want to do another one? Another one. He does. He's back. Lovely. I'm going to take out a one of these and another scarecrow because I don't actually need two. I don't actually need three. <clears throat> um, really a mix of health and damage. Fair enough. I would I would just look into it. You can go to Sky City and see what the stats are of all of the gear um, without actually farming for them, or you can Google it. Um, because the crafted gear is exactly the same stats as the dropped gear. Um, that's just more of a fail-safe of, oh, no, I, I didn't get it after 500 million years. You know, sort of like a fail-safe, but that's okay. Um, but it's exactly the same stats, so I would recommend um, looking. I shouldn't have done that. Oh, well. That was a bad play. Looking for yourself and seeing what you prefer. Um, and just, what I do is I just put it in a spreadsheet, as you can see. Um, I put this in a spreadsheet, and this is the gear that I'm getting, and I put all of the stats there. And those are the stats that I'm going to get at the end of it. So, yeah. Put it in a spreadsheet, add it all up, and see what you, what, what goes where, and just, like, put in random numbers um, of different gear pieces until, it, until you get something that kind of looks good. That's my, that's my opinion on that. <clears throat> we may get another round of the cheats because you joined a second after me. What? What? Um. How much time did that take? Not too long. Probably about two hours of just like putting in random gear pieces into a. A calculator i like to call it and um just seeing what resulted out at the end i mean i kind of had a clear picture of what i wanted i knew that i wanted to keep um i wanted to keep my pet so i just put that in easy clap um and then i originally just put in all of my current gear and started changing out obviously my main thing was changing out the robe so i just took out the robe and put it as the lemuria robe because that gives the most health um, between that and Dragoon, um, because health was something that I really wanted as well, um, and then I put in a whole bunch of other gear, just used the wiki to find other gear until I found a, a gear set that basically gave me the exact same stats, a little bit less, um, a little bit more in some parts, and as I have currently, but using the Lemuria robe, so... Yeah. Is it the best death gear set? No, it isn't. But it will work for me. And that's all that I care about. <laughs> Spreadsheets are amazing. Spreadsheets are amazing. All you need is mana and energy. I have I have an amazing energy set, not gonna lie. I even have an energy pet. That's how crazy I am with energy. I absolutely pop off. I have an energy pet now. Which is crazy. I just got bored. And, um... There's so many pet promenades that I'm like, you know what? Energy pet. <laughs> so I made an energy pet on a wee little imp, and it's so cute. I didn't get, go the Dapper Call gear route because I don't really, I don't really care that much about having like, I need to get max energy because I am min maxer. You know, I don't really care about that. Um, I just wanted more energy because more energy better. Um, <laughs> So yeah, and then I completed it with uh, the gear from the Lemuria pack, the Heroes Fort pack, or whatever it's called. So yeah, I have over 300 plus energy now, which is crazy. I think like crazy, crazy. Um, but yeah, I would recommend just just like looking around and adding up, looking at gear, adding up what you want. Um, yeah, I do have to keep two pieces of. For the set that I'm going for, I have to keep two pieces of Dragoon gear, which I currently only have one, um, only the boots, because the other ones weren't a big enough upgrade for me to get at the time, um, mainly for the set bonus of accuracy, because accuracy be lacking. Accuracy be lacking. Should I just hit, or should I blade again? I think I might blade once more and then hit. I think is plan. Honestly think that is plan here. Blade one more, hit next, easy clap. Actually, wait. Yeah, we can hit next. We get another pip, I think. I think that's the plan. <clears throat> um, yeah. But yeah, it didn't take me too long. 
And I would highly recommend doing that. I'm going to do that for my fire later this year. Once I've got my death gear, we're going to try and max out my fire and get as much damage. I'm going to go probably glass cannon fire. Actually, is that a good idea? Is that a good idea? Because if I'm doing the next world with Rose on her fire, that may not be a good idea. That may not be a good idea. Hmm. Hmm. Rose, are you going like glass cannon fire? Or are you going more of like a an all-round fire? <clears throat> Just out of curiosity. Because <laughs> that would change. You can do balance. I, I, you do balance? Okay. I might go glass cannon then. Just for fun. Or maybe I do balance. Actually, no. It's probably best if I do balance if it's too fire. I need to, I need to like take into account. I need to take into account how I'm leveling up as well. I can't just go glass cannon. As much as I would love to. Rose on a fire cannot heal me. <laughs> if it was my fire in her life, that would be another story. But I think my myth character is going to be my glass cannon character. Um... Who would you recommend farming for Amber? Um, I usually farm, as in garden, for Amber. I use King Parsley's. Um, but if you're farming, usually Gladiator or Cronus. One of those two. Um, Gladiator is a little bit harder to solo than Cronus. So, if that's not really your thing, definitely don't do that. Would not recommend. But um, I, I, can, I can solo... Cronus, not Cronus, Gladiator pretty comfortably on my death. And I could do that at level 100. So, yeah. It's, it's a little bit touch and go on some runs if you get bad RNG. But I can solo him successfully on my death. And I've done that since about level 100. Um, but I would not recommend... If you're any other school other than death, it's a lot harder to solo um, Glad than Cronus. And King Parsley's, I just do that because it's a little bit easier. I don't have to like worry as much. It won't give you as many... like as quickly but it's not terrible i feel not terrible you do chrono since you don't have king past these right now i do gladiator but his cheats are insane i would not recommend doing gladiator if you want it like really quickly just go for chrono sales quick game oh your balance oh even worse yeah no don't don't do don't do gladiator don't do gladiator no 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 no, no, no. Oh, he's still alive again? Oh my gosh. Solomon never dies. He, he never, he never dies. <laughs> he's really a death wizard. He just won't die. Oh my gosh. <clears throat> SMH, my head. I can, um, ship a fools. If needed. Soon, TM. In like a couple of, in like th three, four rounds. <coughs> when we get another pip um another two pips actually get one after this round and then one around after i believe um <coughs> pretty satisfying to use snack attack on that man's am i right brent no never never use snack attack on anyone never ever ever i could do gladiator if i only use nested fury slash old ones in game but you're not exactly a masochist fair enough Fair enough. No, I, I don't... If you want it quick, there's no point, like... There's no point, like... Doing hard stuff when you can do easy stuff, you know? Like, it, it just doesn't really... There's just no real point. Okay, can I, um... We do this, I guess. We do this. He's got a brace as well. Which sucks. It's not actually a brace. Stop calling me a dog. Oh my gosh. Man's out here calling me a dog like it's nothing. How dare he. How dare he. Honestly, offended. <clears throat> what was the malevolent piece that I got? Was it that life hat? Merciless myth. Malevolent myth wand. And merciless. Merciless um, balance boots. And fire hat. Oh, I got the fire hat. Pog. That's actually really good. That's actually really good. Nice. Please don't. Please actually stay dead. He probably will because we had a prism. 
I might change that to my fire because that could be actually a decent upgrade. I would say. Yeah, looks like he's dead. Okay. Pog. <coughs> Pog. Back. 30 of 50. Halfway. Nice. Congratulations. Dun, dun, du, 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 du. <clears throat> that one went a lot quicker. Any percent Hall of Heroes run speed runs? <laughs> Duo speed runs of Hall of Heroes? Imagine. I carry too much of my deck at the moment to do speed runs. <clears throat> Way too much. Um, isn't half of 50 25? I don't math, so in my mind, 30 is. You know, because you should always have extras afterwards, otherwise you have to farm all over again. That's my theory, obviously. Not because not because I'm bad at math. Obviously, that would not ever be the reason. No, no, no. No. You have to have extras, you know. Solomon doesn't stay alive for three turns, it's quick. True. True, 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 true. True. <laughs> true. If Solomon would just stay dead for one minute. <laughs> that would be so nice. Half of 50 is 69. Exactly. Exactly. Half of 50 is 69. Makes so much sense. <clears throat> Makes complete sense. I think this might be my last run. My voice is giving out and I, I've only like, just like yesterday started having a voice back a little bit. So, um, this will probably be my last run. Just to, so it doesn't completely die. <laughs> um, but yeah. But yeah. I just can't, like, stream too much at the moment because voice be... Voice be fragile at the moment. Very fragile. A 70 death shield? Really, man? That's not cool. All good. That's not very poggers. Please stop, man. Please stop, my friend. Um, we do this. Drink honey with tea. Or tea with honey. No, I'm gonna probably have warm water with honey and, um, lemon juice. That's my fave. That's my fave. But yeah, we'll finish off this run. And then I might go and switch over the hat to my fire and see what it looks like and see how sexy he looks. Because damn, he's going to look so sexy. He's going to be the hottest fire wizard ever. Um, also going to need five more agave nectar for this after the crafting quest. See, I told you you were halfway. I told you. I told you. Since I was an idiot and decided not to do the crafting quest. You didn't decide to do the dark crafting quest. No. If. Honestly, Dragonspire and Zafaria are the two hardest. Aztec is kind of bad, but not too bad. Um, Dragonspire will kill you. Especially if you're doing it, like, at Dragonspire, it kills you. Um, and then Zafaria is just painful. Life Dispel. Wow. I was going to heal, man. You got me. You got me good there. You got me good. I was going to cast Big Pigsy. Big Pigsy or something. Um, I'm going to do this. Dylan's going to get off that fat shield. <clears throat> I'll hit next with Scarecrow. Crow Scare. Thankfully, you didn't sell your opponent trap. Nice. Is that... Actually, no, that's the, that's the Azteca one, isn't it? I can't remember where Potent is. Is that Zafari or Azteca? I always forget. Because Azteca is the, um, the shield. And I think it's the drums in Zafari, I think. I think, from memory. The drums. I can't really remember those crafting recipes off my top of my head. I just know that they're kind of painful. Kind of painful. <clears throat> yeah, potent TCs are hard to get because you cannot auction them. So you have to get them through the quests and the bosses. And it's painful. I get, I get um, things... Because I have, like, a whole bunch of stuff on crafting on my YouTube channel. And, um, and it's just painful having people be, like, how to get, how to get potent trap. Like, literally, like, at least two times a month, I'll get, like, a comment saying, how to get potent trap. Please help. Need desperately. And it's just kind of sad. Kind of sad. Um, but yeah. Yeah, people struggle. People struggle with that. Chrysalis crafting is super easy. Also, um, revered crafting is also pretty difficult for a lot of people. 
unless you have like a surplus of um participation trophies and all of the reagents like me then it's a piece of cake but if you don't have that it's painful as rose would know i i purposely um spite did it for her with her in a call because um i had everything and i managed to just get my character to do that quest like in five minutes of, of getting it with just simply transferring everything from my death wizard and she's like this is not fair please stop <laughs> it was so funny it was so funny <laughs> i get i get the trophies from um daily assignments because i i'm really decent at daily assignments like i try and do them most days um and also scroll of fortune helps a lot as well at the moment because there's at least one every scroll of fortune in the last like three that have had participation trophies and i hit just because he didn't die again this is why you have a backup hitter i take credit completely for killing this boss because dylan could not first he fizzles and now he can't even kill bosses it's a slippery slope guys i tell you <laughs> it's a slippery slope man don't worry i'm just kidding dylan i love you i love you i would love you if you were if you were a worm what are we getting oh ring pog i accidentally clicked my gift box um boot merciless merciless malevolent malevolent it's merciless we're looking for merciless, merciless is good i need to remember that i like look over merciless i'm like that's the bad tier merciless doesn't sound as good as um as malevolent malevolent sounds a lot better than merciless in my opinion it was storm boots and fire deck storm booties oh my gosh oh my gosh fire booties storm booties i can transfer both of those to my fire not the storm booties storm booties are dead to me because i don't need them on any of my characters because my storm cannot transfer and then it was a balance wand and what was the other thing um wand boots wand and boots well we'll lock those we're getting like my fire completely done while getting my death done this is so good man <laughs> so good also my myth also my myth getting done as well myth fm kind of cool kind of cool um nice 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 thank you dylan for the help appreciate it very much appreciate it merciless fire deck cool thank you thank you thank you much appreciate it 